you know what fucked OG the most, or especially Amar, is the fact that Walter, Walter, who's the best Dota player? Nine says it. Ti winner. Let's see. Best Dota player. I would agree that it's. All right, there it is. St scroll. Five minutes ago, boys, fresh off the press, from a pop star to proving himself as one of the best in the world, we're proud to have to be part of this incredible journey. Our offlaner Amar Al Saf has been. I probably butchered that. <laughs> has been moved to our inactive roster, and we'll be able to explore options for this season. Thank you for everything, Amar. Salute. Damn. That is crazy. So, just for context, this guy came out this year and also captained. Well, sorry, I'm not sure if captain, but he drafted at least most of OG's uh, runs in the majors. They won a major, they won ESL1 uh, Malaysia, and they did really well. And now, a little bit lackluster TI performance, I guess, for OG, and he's uh, out. He's out. We don't we don't really see the detail right here, um, but uh, seems like maybe kicked. I don't know. Maybe kicked, maybe uh, there was a conflict, like maybe Amar didn't want to play with somebody in the team and they're like, make a choice, Amar or this guy, and then they, you know, something like that. But look, now OG have some options. They hey, can... Gorge, uh... what's your fav carry ATM? Wait, don't interrupt my ranting. I'll ask her after. <laughs> uh, OG can bring back Seb offlane, it's possible. Or they can get a new offlaner, possibly as well. Uh, interesting, Yuragi's gonna have a lot more space to play carry. Uh, will the team be better? I don't know about that. Amar is good, but I think OG... You know what o fucked OG the most? Or especially Amar? Is the fact that... I think if they didn't win all those majors and those ESLs and whatnot, guys... His heroes wouldn't have been nerfed and he would have had a better TI. Tundra, unironically, made their TI run, but kind of choking on lands before. So their heroes didn't get even nerfed that hard. And meanwhile, OG's, like, Amaro had a small hero pool, it's just the way it is. His staple heroes just got nerfed. Razor, Viper nerfed, like, Razor hyper nerfed, guys. Fahaskar, like, everything. They got fucked by winning majors. You have to, you cannot actually win all the tournaments before TI, it's impossible. It's actually detrimental to your team. And it's kind of been proven lately as well, right? None of the teams that were winning tournaments before TI won TI, you know? Maybe Team Spirit won a little bit before their TI, but not, like, that much. So it's kind of fucking them actually. 33 planned it. You know what? I'm starting to suspect. It's looking sussy, boys. It's a real strat. It's a real strat. Just play more hero isn't a really good uh, argument, sir. I know you. It's very hard because you're competing against other people that are playing on the same level as you, that practice other heroes for 12 hours a day. How are you gonna, trying your best to win, also gonna be on the same level as them when they're playing more? You're not going to. It's just not gonna happen. Uh, but yeah, pretty crazy. They confirmed it. Yeah, I think we'll see how OG does now. I think they'll do well. They have some good players in that team t still. I think. So I'm a big fan of uh, I'm a big fan of uh, some of their still team. I wonder where Amar is gonna go though. Is he gonna play carry? Hmm. Hmm. I'm not really sure. Uh. We'll see. I guess Amar the benched. <laughs> He's also like 16 as well, so... Yeah, 17 I think actually, I'm not really sure how old he is, everyone keeps correcting me. But, yeah, that's big, that's really big. Moving on. Team Bald? Nah, he's gonna do better, boys, he's gonna do better. They still have Seb? Yeah, we'll see, maybe they'll get a real off laner, maybe Seb... Because Seb has been playing 5 a lot lately, and then maybe they'll kick another guy, and... I don't know, who knows what's gonna happen. 33's mom's Facebook post on their son's win. From the age of 12 he plays for hours on the computer. At the age of 17, he sat us down to watch a documentary called Free to Play so we could understand what this game Dota 2 is. And he plans to do in life, to be a professional esports player. Damn, 17. That was 8 years ago, I did not know him then. At all. By the age of 25, he said, he want, I want to win a major international tournament. Today, at the age of 25 and a half, he fulfilled his dream. Damn, half a year. Giga Chad. <laughs> Only took him half a year to achieve his dream. Holy shit. Zugan, 54 months. Yo, brother. Yo. Hope you're doing good, man. <clears throat> I got into Volvo office. I want to share what I saw there. I saw a new Persona to see him. <laughs> nice. Kid named Finger of Death. A kid named Finger. I get it. Walter. Walter. There are two types of Dota players. 
For now, we're scattered in the wind. Some will be taking breaks. Other may form a stack together. Quincy mean a lot to me. And the name will not be used on anything and sort of team with the highest aspirations. Damn. So... Love the stream. Because so Quincy is like... Bombed. They're all gone. I see. They're all bombed. So that means Quinn is a free agent for mid, guys. Where could he go? Hmm. Where could Quinn go? The coincident happened? I forgot about that. That was a good one. Coincident that DI happened and they just scattered. Interesting. We'll see. Callahan in Japan? Where is he going? Could anything could happen. We'll see. The coincident was good though. <laughs> I like that one. I lost my best friend today. One of forgettable memories here watching Manila Majors. Sag. X Nova LFT willing to relocate. That's kind of crazy. Thunder 9 having to ask mid, please. It is. I know you're taking a picture on your phone, but he, someone picked Tusk and went mid. He disregarding his request. <laughs> he is not actually the highest ranked mid laner, though, to be fair. So if people don't know that he won TI, you know? Any, the person that sat at home and watched anime instead of watching TI for inspiration, you know? He might not know. What is 9 named on my friend list? I have no idea, actually. He's here somewhere. Uh, Gary player... Is it him? No, I don't think it's him. Probably him. He's 115, I think. No, it's not him, is it? Huh. I'm not sure who... What is he named? I don't know, either way, he's like rank 150 or something, or I don't remember really. I don't, I haven't nicknamed everybody, so. Ah. Woof woof, maybe this guy? Ah, fuck it, it doesn't matter. Maybe it is this guy, woof woof. He's playing Tusk, that's the one? Yeah, ah, he's rank 46 now, he's a bit higher. He used to be like 150 or something. And it's hard getting your rolls if you're not top 100, guys, I'll tell you what. He's the fucking hard getting it. Look, that's actually a ghoul though, guys. Wiping the blood of the side of your mouth? Holy shit, dude. That is ghouly as fuck. Very ghouly. Alright, what do we have here? Uh, anything left on Reddit worth checking out? My Reddit? Mm. Ah, it's okay, we checked out most of it. Carry player when support asks who took the toll. Jeez. DPD was doing his best acting in that fucking thing. Let's get the TI. Currently a seasonal game mode and candy works are active in the corner. Hi boys, dire tide soon. Hey Gorpy, I have recently okay. been permabanned for posting booba clips. I am incredibly sorry and I oh. swear I will never post anything stupid again. I have been watching since the very beginning and I just want to see the chat again, Sag. Alright, Dizzlehead, I'll unban you. No more, no more booba clips, you seem what sorry at least. What is the least. next rank, Gold Gorpow? Uh, Sonic, thanks for the four months. Sirenford, thanks for gifting a sub. Thank you, Sirenford. Appreciate it. What's the next goal rank? I don't really know. Let like, I'm kind of chilling. I want to recalibrate you, like uh, my title says, and then we'll see where I land. We'll see where I land. Because right now, a patch is coming soon, and like, Giga tryharding right now for some rank seems a bit bad. So I'm kind of waiting for the patch to see. Baphomet, thank you. Aver, Mr. LKN, 24 months. Two years, thank you. Aver, HSB, Xflame, thank you. Uh, the top daughter streamers have a problem with stream sniping. I recommend not showing you start queuing. Yeah, there's been a lot. I think the stream sniping has gone a little bit worse lately. Someone link me, link me a clip. Who's the best daughter player? Nine says it. TI winner, let's see. If he doesn't say me, then I'm sad. It's me, surely. It's me. Best daughter player? I would agree that it's Miracle. I think on his peak, he was... Miracle? Super. I think it's like one of the only players that I watched and I thought like, True. holy shit. He's not wrong. Usually when I watch games, I'm not really like... Super impressed by people. Like obviously they're good, but they're not like... When Miracle plays Dota, it feels like magic. It's when true. When he used to, at least. When he used to, yeah. Well, he didn't say me, so I don't know why you linked the clip, guys. Obviously, it's me. But, I mean, this is the standard answer. Miracle Peak Miracle was the best Dota, Dota player that has been seen, I think. I do think... I'm not saying Miracle's washed or fall off, but I don't think he's as good compared to other people. People caught up, and also, maybe he got a little bit uh, less motivated after he won a TI and all that. So, things happen, you know? 
You, I can't imagine he probably grinds as much as he did back then. But he showed the people how to play mid, you know? Hi, like, George. For a while. Like, actually how to play. Yeah, nice funk music right here. Yo, thank you, Orbsarga. Appreciate it, man. First 9k MR player. Yeah, I remember that. That was a big one. What do you think about the new EG team? I mean, it's just Thundra Awaken, right? It's uh, hard to say what to think about it. I don't... It's the same team, dog. <laughs> it's just different sponsor. I mean, I hope they don't make them wear those shitty jerseys that they wore this year. Because honestly, after they saw, I saw those on the main stage, I kind of was hoping they would lose. So I didn't have to see them again. They were so garbage. EG's jerseys. <laughs> 